Hey everybody, Crabby Asus, we welcome. Uh, we are going to do the Diamond Kings uh, full case number two, Rip City card style right now. So come this way. Um, let me get this squared up. I mean, many, many fancy things in Diamond Kings. I mean, the, the vet content is pretty special. I mean, because the vet stuff is like mostly like Hall of Fame kind of kind of deal business. Yeah, it's, it's not it's not your weird uh, weird guys here and there. So <clears throat> let's see what we got. We'll be going hard on uh, honors after this. If you want to uh, take some time to look at RipCityCards.com and uh, get in on honors, <clears throat> I think since these feel a little wobbly, I think I'm gonna pack stack box by box. Expect some very fancy amazingness from this. I mean, this. I mean, it's, I don't know, nine hundred dollars a box. It's not that good. It's not that good. It's gonna be. I mean, it's gonna be even crazier for everybody when I when I end up being the one to pull like the Luca logo man, one on one. I'm gonna have to put like my A game on for the entire time that I'm uh, breaking the NT basketball. In case it is a uh, video for uh, you know, prosperity. They will get get watched by uh, you know kids at Christmas and Easter and Thanksgiving and like all of that kind of business. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, I mean, it was forty-eight hundred dollars a case on uh, on blowout. The, the last time that they had it available for purchase, forty-eight hundred dollars a case. I mean, that is one thousand two hundred dollars a box for what eight cards? That's I mean it's just it's just it's a staggering dollar amount. No, it's yeah, it's it's going to be 
I mean, it, it's 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 going to be a thirty thousand. It's going to be like a thirty thousand dollar card. Hot, like top end. Oh, it's it's gonna make bakers it's gonna make bakers look like chump change. I mean, basketball's just like that. It's an inter I mean, an international market. It is just consistently like the highest like valued type. You know, type deal that, that you know that there is in in cards. How has Luke even been doing lately? Like, has has he kept up his? Uh his rookie of the year pace. Who doesn't love basketball, rah rah? I mean, that's almost racist. I've sent many basketball cards to uh, South America. I've sent many to uh, Ireland. Sent, sent a couple to Mongolia. I don't, I don't know. Do you consider Mongolia uh, Asians? It's a racist compliment. <laughs> Chris Fitz, did you, uh, dude? When I, when I saw him like crying uh, at at his like last and you know like last. Spot, you know, spot of him going into a game. It, ma it made me sad. Oh, right, right. What, what's your uh, what's your twenty three and me uh, look like? Italian Asian, fitty fitty. Chris Fitz, I was, I mean, I was just talking earlier how I said, like, I didn't, I didn't think that people, like, understood how good Dirk was. Like, everybody know, everybody know Dirk good, but I, but I don't think that people, like, grasp how much of a game-changing character he was, like a seven-footer who could play point, who could play forward, who could play center, who would hit the three. Like, it's, it's ridiculous. Italian and Filipino. Have you been to the Philippines, Ra Ra, to uh, see your family? Yeah, dude, D. Wade didn't even check out with 30,000. I mean, I think, I think D-Wade only had like 26 or something, 25, 26, something like that. Nice. I mean, like, like to see family or just like for the, like the young girls? And Chris Fitz, that's a whole nother thing. 30,000 points? 
I mean, that's a lot of points. That's a lot of points. Rara, I had no idea. That you were going like, going out for that stuff. Dude, I mean, next time next time you go, if uh, if you're looking for somebody to tag along, I would I mean, I would very much enjoy the trip if nothing but for the uh for the cuisine and the uh And the views. That's the other thing, Chris Fitz. To me, like there is nothing more special than somebody that stays with one team for their entire career. I understand like the money and moving and stuff. Like I get that. I don't I don't I don't begrudge anybody that. But to but to like you know Draft and finish with the same team to me is just huge, dude. Rara, you might want to talk to uh, Mr. Do. I mean, that guy is like a travel expert. I am on his uh, his uh, private Instagram uh, travel feed, and I mean, he, he just, I mean, he sees like the most amazing things, and he's doing like in like a uh, like an Asia, like Southeast Asia trip right now. You'd be under control. Come on. I, I don't I can't even imagine you out of control. But all the times I've met you, like I don't I just I don't I don't see it. I think your out of control would be like my like mildly agitated state. Oh, so many packs. So many packs. I'm still mad that the uh, that the damn Lightning lost their last game. How how you give up a three? Uh... Well, rah rah. If that's the case, then if if I end up making it to the next nationals, I want to see that. We're gonna go downtown. Get rowdy. I'll give Jesse like a traveler's check or something uh, to use for bail money. I mean, we'll skip bail, obviously, and just, uh, you know, go back to our respective states and never return uh, to that place. But, you know. You know, what does it hurt if you if you never go back to uh, you know New Jersey, really? Does anybody care? I don't think so. Oh, see, sorry. Oh, you, oh, you, you. You, you would have to be watching me then, huh? Oh, well, Eric, the answer is pretty much zero now that you've disrespected me by calling me Jesse. So, the answer is uh, pretty much hell to the N-O. Hashtag nada. But I like it anyway. So yeah, I'll send you some. Let me make a note. I got you.
Note has been made. It shall be done. I got you, Eric. I'm just busting your uh, busting your bug angles. I know that uh, many people can get confused with Jess, you know, with Jesse's youthful uh, exuberance and uh, and my lack of uh, youthful exuberance. I get it. I get it. I understand. No, I, I'll, I'll send you a four a four hundred a four hundred count box of them. Be all right. I mean, really, the only difference between Jesse and I is hand color and uh, sports call sports card knowledge. It's the only the only thing that differentiates us. I mean, you know, if, if we're being uh, being real about it, no, I mean, it's like it's uh, it's like seven bucks, Eric. It's, it's, it, it, it's nothing. It's fine. Right? I got you, dog. I got you. It's, 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 a, it's a priority package. I mean, hell, for that matter, I guess I could just shove them, uh, shove as many as, as, as I could uh, come up with in a, in a priority flat rate envelope. It'd be like the same difference. Just remember, in the future, Jesse's brown. I'm white. I know about sports cards. And he kind of does, too. So I got to worry about. Chris Fitz, if you're even still here, like, I mean, 21 years, I, it does not seem to me that he has played that many seasons. Because, I mean, can anybody believe Dirk 21 years with the Mavs? I honest, 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 honest. Would have, uh, no, you know, basketball, no question he crushes my ass. No question. Football, I feel like we're even. Baseball, I only know slightly more because I pay attention more to like some weirdos that are on here about baseball. But basketball, I mean, he he lays me to waste. Like, he knows way more about that. Way, way, way more about that. All right, let me grab a box and a drink of water real quick.
Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Okay. Uh, Chris Fitz, that's it's just crazy. Okay, so a Patrick Wisdom autographed 49 for the uh, Texas Rangers coming out uh, early. Uh, for the rest of this. Such a page is short print. Kirby Puckett, one of my favorite uh, players of all time. A Jose Ramirez Deca. It's just like quad quadro, sort of. A uh, Giancarlo Stanton. Uh, Paint frame. A crowning moment for Mickey Betts. That's a uh, variation. I did that, Chris? That's just crazy to me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have Chris. That's why, why I don't not believe you like I'm gonna have to even look because I cannot believe that he's played for 21 years come on lightning why are you gonna do that hey how, how you gonna how you gonna do that Crush the entire regular season and then lose to some trash team. First round of playoffs. A Mark Mike Trout artist proof. Must be unnumbered. Get our Molina. Stewart frame. I have not seen any shirts, Chris Fitz. I haven't been on. I haven't been online a whole lot this. Uh, this past uh, week or so, I've been spending like an extra amount of time with my uh, with my little baby girl. Like she has seemed to be like a little bit more interested in me, uh, like this past week or so. A Harvey Coon to forty nine for the Tigers. Yeah, well, see, you know, see, I've only really, really seen like the Wade stuff. Like, I mean, Miami's been like all about, you know, D Wade's like, you know, last game. On the Wagner frame. A real Muto frame. Is right on top. I'll just take a uh, Soto frame. Uh, okay, I will. I will look that up then. I don't know, the only thing that uh, pops up for most of my stuff, a uh, Jake Cave for the Twins, is uh, him falling over uh, John Legend and. Uh, his wife, I forget. I can't forget her name. And I got to tell you, even one like one of my like all time favorites. And even though he's like you know like a secondary player or whatever, but Udonis Haslam 
He was a gator. Uh, just like bench. I mean, if they gave like a hall of a hall of fame for like bench players, Haslam would be in it. Love, love, love Udonis Haslam. Uh, Sewell artist proof. He retired too. I mean, I don't know. He, he won't get the love he deserves. But I mean, I mean, dude's played forever. And has just been like a consistently solid, uh, you know, solid player, teammate, everything. Wade Boggs, short print. Carl Hubble frame. A Beltre short print. Okay, let me get base cards out of the way. Rookie cards out of the way, short prints out of the way, and general inserts out of the way. Okay, there we go. Okay. Let's see if we can't go a little bit. Larry Doby short print. Artist proof for Al K line. Adrian Beltre, Growing Moments. Kevin Kramer. Frame. I feel like I'm losing the room on this uh, particular break. I feel, like I feel like I'm losing them. Like, like, like you're almost not interested in a uh, Jake Bowers autograph for the Cleveland Indians. Like you were kind of waiting for it, and then like it finally came, and like maybe you're not here now to see it kind of situation. Since this is right on top, I'll take a Rivera framey card. Crowning moment uh, for Pedro Martinez. Uh, short print versionistness. No, don't even uh, do me like that. A uh, Yadier Molina. Short printy type thing. Jacob Nix plays for San Diego is framed. So you got you got that going for you for San Diego. I I mean you know I feel like almost this is almost like the uh, like the court kings of uh, of baseball kind of sort of almost. Satchel Page 
variation. We got to uh, Frank Thomas, Chicago White Sox. Two color uh, swatch awesomeness. Oh, European bison. They are the they are the toughest of bisons. So, Aussie Jim off the hook. The, I mean, the fact that Aussie Jim even put down his bow long enough to say like hunting European bison uh, says something. That's a uh, Juan Soto to 99. Single, single, double, triple for the Nationals. You bow hunting those things, Aussie Jim, or uh, or or are you going uh, full blown rifle style? I mean, the the easy answer if it's not bow, it's no go. Blake Snell, uh, frame deal. Their Howard variation. A Christian Stewart dual swatch autograph of the Tigers. Oh, I mean, really, Oz Jim, thirty off thirty, where you got you got to do nothing but a headshot. I mean, that's it's forty forty seven forty five seventy garbage. Caleb Ferguson is a short print. A Jesus Aguilar. Framed business. Jesse is fine. He is uh, at home on the mend. Got to, got released from the hospital about eleven thirty uh, last night. A Kikuchi uh, variation. Um. I don't know what story do you want me to tell you, Steve. Because I have several stories running about what exactly happened to Jesse. All of them are pretty, uh, pretty fancy. Matt Carpenter frame. I mean, I can tell you the truth. I can tell you something uh, entertaining. It's kind of, kind of up to you. Although the truth is. Pretty dis I mean, pretty like relatively disgusting. Like not necessarily something that you in fact want to hear. But no, he's feeling better. He's he's uh, on some antibiotics and. Uh, No, no, no painkillers, which is uh, upsetting for. I mean, upsetting for him and and for myself on top of it. But he doing all right. He he'll, he'll be back soon. See, rah, rah, that would be a problem for me because I can't, I cannot sleep on my stomach. I can sleep on my side, kind of, but really only on one side. Then, so yeah, it's not good, Steve. It's not good. Maybe he's got like some weird pillow that like forces his like legs up into the air or something. I don't know. The uh, Cabrera 
frame. A, uh, a Talese, or Talese frame. I mean, you know, I, I'm personally like mildly shocked that uh, anybody even cares about Jesse. The uh, growing moments, Alex Rodriguez variation. I mean, because I don't, I, I don't care about him. You know, I mean, I mean, the only thing to me that he is, and ours is proof of uh, Luke Garrick actually. You know, it's just, uh, you know, somebody to be online. Well, I'm not, you know. It, it, it's not like I'm his kid's, uh, his kid's grandfather, or not grand, or, uh, what is not grandfather? It's, uh, why can't I, why can't I think of the words? His his kids. So I'm getting a little bit worried about myself. Kyle Tucker, Godfather, sweet mother of mercy. I'm I'm getting worried. I'm getting a little bit worried about my brain, Aussie Jim. I'm getting a little bit worried about it. Yeah, I'm his. I mean, I'm I'm his kid's Godfather. And, you know, so I so I so I do in fact you know care care deeply about him. Vlad Senior variation. A uh, Rivera variation. A Mel Ott to seven dual relic. I don't know. I mean, sometimes it makes sometimes it makes me a little bit nervous. Other times, I just don't care. Like, you know, like if if I can't express my words to you in the time that uh, and it's game game used the uh, odd to seven. If I can't express the words that I want to you in the time that you know that's important to you, then you know, so what. I, I believe very deeply in the Kyle Tucker, Eric. I believe very deeply in the Kyle Tucker. Uh, Yelich variation. Sheffield uh, dual relic for the Mariners. I, I think, I mean, especially considering this game, I mean, I, well, I guess it would be hard for them to get a uh, a player worn uh, at this point, but but yeah, I mean, I, it, to me, that I mean, to me, it's a very cool card. That's what I mean. That's why I, that's kind of why I like Diamond Kings because there's like a lot of like old dudes in it. You know, a lot of guys you're not ever going to see show up in, like, Don Russ or Score or something. Nolan Ryan frame. A Hohane frame. Tani's supposed to be back like next month, I think, or there, like this. Yeah, yeah, this, yeah, this next coming month on the DH. I don't think he. I thought I'm thinking he's going to crack. A uh, Vlad Guerrero, but it is senior. It is senior, so it is uh, Expos going to the Nationals. Dual relic and autographed. Uh, 
You know, his, his boy blowing stuff up. Torres, refract, or... Variation. Corbin Burns, frame card. K-line uh, frame. Uh, Hideki Matsui. Glowing moments. Uh, I'm thinking that's a variation. Supposedly everything flipped around in this thing is some type of variation. So... A uh, Miles Straw variation. Okay, clean this up. Move that over there. Oof! Three more stacks of this. Okay. Rookies there. Frames there. Portrait there. Ah. Sorry. Didn't I mean to knock all that down? Try to, we're only halfway through this. Got to say, uh, Kyle Tucker. Rookie variation. Javier Baez downtown. Downton, I've seen. I did not know that these were uh, in this thing. Dana Jansen frame. Aguilar variation. This is right on top. We will take a uh, retro 83 DK materials signature hollow blue card number 20 for a George Brett. I wanted this card deeply to be live. Wanted this card deeply to be live. I mean, Brett only ever played for the Royals, right? There's no, there's no, there's no chance of this like some like some weird side team or something, is it? I'll, I'll double check the checklist, but uh, well, I don't know because I mean they've been weird about that uh, Smokey Jenkins with like some other products like Downtowns used to be one of ones. And then in like some like Panini football they had like the the uh, SS you know, like the, the the downtowns like you get like six of them in a case so like I I don't know for certain it has been I mean it is like top sleeve and top loaded you know like taken care of immediately but I'm not sure if it's like hyper rare or just uh, like 
pretty rare. A uh, Alex Rodriguez frame. A uh, Hotani variation. A uh, Giambi variation. A Stoto frame. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna have to check the Brett. But I don't, I don't, George Brett, I don't think George Brett didn't ever play for anybody but the, but the, uh, but the Royals, I don't think. Harper variation, me thinks. The Ramirez frame. Itra variation. Artist proof poo holes. Toussaint variation. Yeah, so I, 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 I thought so, rah rah. I didn't want to get like, you know. Think that he had, you know, he had like, you know, done some weird, weird year with the Tigers or something. That's a good card. I mean, again, I wish it was live because that, because that was one of those that I was looking at the checklist. And I'm like, man, you don't really see a whole lot of Brett autos in stuff. Sean Reed Foley autograph for the Blue Jays. Brett's another one. Brett's another autograph that I would like to have before my collecting, like, but before I just like you know empty everything that I don't care about and and hang on to. Uh... Yeah, man. A uh, retro eighty-three DK, DK material signatures hollow blue for Brett. You know, but before I dump all of my collection, except for like, I'm thinking I would like to like to hang on to like fifty cards when it's all said and done. A Jimenez uh, dual relic. I'm thinking I would like to ch like to, like to chop my business down to like 50 cards. A Tuki Toussaint frame. Joe, how are you doing this evening? Okay, let me put this over here. No, I want to. I want to cut it down to. Okay, maybe fifty. Okay, let's let's just say a hundred or less. 
Maybe, no, 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 no. I mean, I know. I need it to be like 50 cards or less. That just, like, there are 50 cards that I want to have forever and be buried with. To have somebody, you know, like 200 years from now be like, oh, damn, I heard rumors on YouTube that this guy, the Cardboard Jesus, was buried with this card. We're going to have to go, like, you know, in the middle of the night dig up his grave and get his cards. Like I want I want that to be in the news two hundred years from now. Yeah, you know, so I, I so I I'm saying I'm I'm saying cut it down to fifty. And I think even with fifty I've got some room to buy. Now, there's a whole I got I mean I got I got five thousand cards that I don't want. Like, I, that I would just like re- literally rather not have. Rah rah! At some point, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna be doing this anymore. Like at some, at some point, I'm gonna quit breaking. I think once I quit breaking, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna drive up to you. I'm gonna take all the cards that you have, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna sell them for you, so you, so that you don't have to worry about them anymore. A waner uh, variation. A Toussaint uh, duel. Just to you know, just just to just to keep your your soul a little bit, a little bit easier. A Vato uh, frame. Yeah, Freeman. Alina Artist Proof. Uh, De Leon Rookie Variation. The Nationals have nothing without Harper. It's all about the Phillies and the Yankees and the Red Sox and the Astros and the Indians and the uh, Rays and the Cardinals. A Wade Boggs. Boston Red Sox uh, duel. And autograph and the Padres also the Rockies and O'Hearn variation and a uh, Jose Ramirez frame And also the twins, uh, you know, got some stuff going on. Hey, a blank card. And another O'Hearn. Dual relic autograph, the Royals. It's a uh, Glaber Torres variation. Uh, 
The Sam Crawford Detroit Tigres frame. So you have Machado variation. Nice Sam Crawford frame. You think so, JMS? I mean, listen, I mean, if nothing else, I mean, it's it's making Hoskins like, you know, like a next level player. I mean, I mean, pitching around uh, around Harper for Hoskins to get his deal going on. Oh, but you know, but at the same time, like I, I mean, any, anytime anybody signs like some, you know, like like some crazy good deal, you know, the effort, a little bit of effort seems to uh, dip. A uh, Brantley for the Indians to ten. Well, I mean, if I mean, if you're if you're hitting uh, hitting seven home runs game, you know, what does it matter? It's you know, you, I mean, you you can look at it as a offense versus a defense kind of deal. David Wright, potential variation. George Brett Artist Proof. Another uh, Woodson. But this one a variation, not an autograph. Joe Wood. Frame deal. Yeah, I mean, like, you look. I guess, I mean, listen, I mean, you like, you make your choice. Like, are you gonna, are you gonna try and outscore somebody? You know, fifteen to fifteen to ten. Or are you, or are you gonna pay for, uh, pay for short, in, short inning arms? I don't know. You're right. Harper can hit two home runs every night. Crowning moment, Tejeda frame. Rounding moment for Reyes. A Tatis Junior, the Padres.
to why do, why don't I hear about like blockbuster bullpen signings? Like do, do like does just like does that kind of thing not exist? You know what I'm saying? Like, do, do, do they just not exist? Torres, artist proof. Javi Baez, variation. Renato frame. A Jeff McNeil patch autograph. I'm thinking that's Mets. I don't know. I mean, I, I still remember the days when your guy, when your guy went, uh, you know, went went eight innings, went eight or you know, yeah, it went eight. A real Muto variation, and then you had your closer who t who took care of nine. Now we got these little sissy boys that uh, you know can can only pitch four innings. Can't get there. Can't get it all. Can't get it all together, like in the like in the olden days, you know, when uh, you know Ruth could, uh, you know, he could pitch nine, and uh, then, uh, you know, smoke a cigar, and, uh, and you know, and go and go pitch, uh, and then go pitch the rest of the game. What's with these uh these these lazy fools? It's ridiculous. A uh, Goldschmidt uh, crowning achievement. I mean, it's almost like competition has gotten better or something like over the years. And that the game has like changed from what it used to be from a hundred years ago. Senegard variation. I mean, I can't believe that's like the truth because rules and the way the game is played, time wise, and like all of those things have ne have not changed at all. They have not changed at all. There it is, a Wade Boggs artist proof. Thank you, Eric. Thank you. Oh, pork chops. Oh, ooh, cream of corn, Bergy. Interesting. I, I am personally a, a cream of mushroom man on, uh, on my pork chops, but uh, that actually sounds like pretty delicious. Crowning moment for Cabrera, frame style. Hmm, a cream of corn pork chop. Hmm, I'm, I mean, I am legit interested in such a thing. Bergie, how are you doing? Got the Trevor Story variation. A Urias Swatchery. Erskine Frame. A Chance Adams Autographs twenty five. Oh, 
Bergy now now I want some pork chops. Now I want some pork chops. All right, and that's what we have. We have got uh, autographs for the uh, Jeff McNeil for the Mets, a Ryan O'Hearn for the Royals, a Wade Boggs, a dual relic for the uh, Boston Red Sox, George Brett, Retro 83 DK Materials Hollow Blue. That's a nice card. A uh, Sean Reed Foley for the uh, Blue Jays. A uh, Vlad Guerrero Sr. for the uh, Expos. Kyle Tucker Hotness for the Astros. Christian Stewart Hotness for the Tigers. Got a uh, Jake Bowers for the Indians. Got a uh, Jake K for the Twins. A uh, Wisdom for the uh, Sweet Sweet Rangers. And then uh, we have the uh, Chance Adams. Uh, hotness there. So, thank you everybody for this round too.